Alright, so I'm going to be making the DVD logo bouncing animation in 10 lines of code with JavaScript. So here we go. I'm going to start first start by making a new uh, variable square. So this is going to be a create sprite at 200 comma 200 right in the middle of the screen. And this square is going to get a picture set animation. There it is. DVD video PNG one. Boom. Awesome. Now I know how big this is, so I'm going to have to scale down the square by uh, zero. Let's see, zero point five. And this square is going to have velocity x, and I'm going to make that uh, kind of a random number. So this is about the square root of five, but that's just to make sure that it hits a corner. And then uh, this is also going to have a, uh, a velocity in the y direction, and I found that 3.5 works nice. So uh, next up, I'm going to also have to create uh, these things, edge sprites. Make sure that uh, our square can bounce off the edge. And finally, we get to the draw function. So this is what's going to be happening on the screen. First off, every single frame, I want a new fresh background. So I'm going to make that white. Uh, I also want the square to where is it? bounce off of. I want it to bounce off of edges. That's right. I want it to bounce off the edge of the screen. And finally, I'm going to draw all those beautiful sprites on the screen. Perfect, just like that. And make sure it's 10 lines of code. I'm going to move this end bracket up to there. And we'll check it out and see how it goes. So there it is. Um, something's not working. Velocity Y, velocity Y. Um, here it is. We've got the, we've got the L. Uh, now it should be much better. Let's try it. Bam! Awesome! So there it is. DVD video logo in 10 lines of code. Oh, maybe right here. No, no, it's got to be this next one. Okay, here it is. Here it is. Yes, that was totally a corner. That, that was so awesome. All right, anyways, that's about all for the video.